the human heart and its components. The human heart is a hollow muscular organ situated in the left central of the chest, under the lower third of sternum and between the lungs. The walls of the heart are thick, made up of cardiac muscle. The heart has a double-walled sac called the pericardium surrounding it. The space between the heart and the pericardium is filled with fluid. It acts as a lubricant to reduce friction during a heartbeat. The heart is also covered with minute blood vessels. The components of the heart and their function seem very complex at first, but if we follow the blood flow, we will understand what part does what. There are four chambers that work systematically to deliver blood to all cells. Each side has an atrium and a ventricle. The left atrium receives oxygenated blood from the lungs via pulmonary vein and pumps blood to the left ventricle. The mitral valve prevents backflow of blood to the left atrium. The chordae tendinae are tendons that tighten to prevent valves from flapping backwards. The left ventricle pumps oxygenated blood via aorta to all parts of the body except the lungs. The right atrium receives deoxygenated blood and pumps blood to the right ventricle. The tricuspid valve prevents backflow of blood to the right atrium. The right ventricle pumps deoxygenated blood to the lungs via pulmonary artery. Here, the semilunar valves prevent backflow of blood. The septum prevents mixing of oxygenated and deoxygenated blood. The pulmonary artery carries deoxygenated blood to the lungs, while the aorta carries oxygenated blood to the body. Can you recall from the previous lesson what the pulmonary vein does? Yes, it carries oxygenated blood from the lungs to the heart. The superior vena cava returns deoxygenated blood from head and arms to heart. The inferior vena cava returns deoxygenated blood from lower limbs and organs to the heart. It is important to remember that both the vena cava carry deoxygenated blood and return it to the heart, where the right atrium receives it, and thus the cycle continues. Heartbeat. A heartbeat is a heart rhythmic contraction due to the flowing of blood through the heart. Each heartbeat has two phases, diastole and systole. It is a recurrent beat throughout life. During a diastole, the muscles of the atria and ventricle relax. The blood flows into the ventricles. The mitral and tricuspid valves open and semilunar valves close. During an atrial systole, muscles of both atrium contract and both ventricles relax. Again, the blood flows into ventricles. During the ventricular systole, muscles of both the ventricles contract. The blood flows into the pulmonary artery and aorta. The mitral and tricuspid valves close and semilunar valves open. So a heartbeat is composed of a diastole phase, then an atrial systole, a ventricular systole, and back to the diastole and repeat.